Chapter 13 The World Do not follow the evil law. Do not live in thoughtlessness. Do not follow false doctrine. Do not be a friend of the world. Rouse thyself. Do not be idle. Follow the law of virtue. The virtuous rests in bliss in this world and in the next. Follow the law of virtue. Do not follow that of sin. The virtuous rests in bliss in this world and in the next. Look upon the world as you would look on a Hubble. Look upon it as you would on a mirage. The king of death does not see him who thus looks down upon the world. Come, look at this world, glittering like a royal chariot. The foolish are immersed in it but the wise do not touch it. He who formerly was reckless and afterwards became sober brightens up this world like the moon when freed from clouds. He whose evil deeds are covered by good deeds brightens up this world like the moon when freed from clouds. This world is dark. Few only can see here. A few only go to heaven like birds escaped from the net. The swans go on the path of the sun. They go miraculously through the ether. The wise are led out of this world when they have conquered Mara and his train. If a man has transgressed the one law and speaks lies and scoffs at another world, there is no evil he will not do. The uncharitable do not go to the world of the gods. Fools only do not praise liberality. A wise man rejoices in liberality, and through it becomes blessed in the other worlds. Better than sovereignty over the world, better than going to heaven, better than lordship over all worlds, is the reward of Sotapati, the first step in holiness. Let us think upon and meditate on chapter 13, The World.